Score. That's the best score we've seen so far, and I think that's going to put Aldertag in the lead currently with a few more athletes yet to compete in this third rotation. Well, after three rotations, crossing 40, Aldertag has done fairly well. Next up on the floor, and the final athlete is Sofia Cerceri. First tumble pass. Nice. Oh, she stepped out. That's a deduction. Otherwise, very well done. Just took a little bit too much real estate. It was very, very ambitious set of tumbles. Nicely done. It's good, too. Executing the strong tumble well. She has to use all parts of the floor, so that's why she moves around, not just the corners. Okay, nice set of uh, splits and kicks. routine are quite dance-like. Nice spin. She lost a little bit of control there at the end of the spin. Getting ready for the next tumbling pass. Here she goes. One, two, three. Very ambitious spin at the end. spend a bit of time on the corners between moves and correct that and could just well what that basically does it just it just shortens the amount of time available for the other stuff so it means that lowers her degree of difficulty well executed i think the artistry was good i do agree with you that she did spend a, a fair amount of time in sort of transition between elements i can end up costing her I think that's the best we've seen so far from Sir Sari today. Sir Sari today. First time we pass. And this is well done. Now watch what happens on the land. She just steps a little bit outside the perimeter. That's going to wrap it up for the athletes for this third rotation. Of course, we still need to wait for the score for Sir Sari. But until we get that score, Yona Aldertag of Sweden is in the lead with 40.2 points. Grandestine 